Eight years ago, my daughter Riley, we actually took her to a race, and since then, it's been just nothing but fun and memories. What started as a love for the sport turned into the first and only public track for snowcross racers in the state. <laughs> this place actually used to be the Mansalona Motorplex. So we actually, there was a three lane drag strip over here. That was about the only thing that was on the property besides a well. So we kind of developed the property. This year we did lighting, added additional snow guns and stick guns. We did our retaining pond for our water for our snow guns to help cool it from the well. Lots of infrastructure is what we put in. And it's drawing out a crowd. All across the state, actually from Pennsylvania, Ohio, Illinois. Last weekend we had people here from Canada. Uh, the UP even. With some racers coming in for the track, local riders are headed out to compete nationally. We go to the national circuit too. They're all over the place like North Dakota, South Dakota, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Iowa, Michigan. Um, some of them are pretty far drives. Uh, the furthest one I've ever been to is Wyoming, Jackson Hole, Wyoming, which that was a pretty long hike there. No matter what age or experience level you're at, this track is the place for you. There's plenty of competition, but everybody helps one another out. It's just a great family family sport to be able to come out and make memories. Though like any sport, it takes time and training, but it's worth it in the end. You always get the crashes, but it's more fun than that. Up in the air is so much fun. And the view from above is unlike any other, but one racer says it best. You can't watch it from a video. It's, you got to see it live. In Mancelona, Emma Hug, 9 and 10 News.